There are so many vitamins constantly in the media. B12 is one that we often hear about, but we're, today we're going to be talking about vitamin B5, which is pantothenic acid. The thing about vitamin B5 or pantothenic acid is it's actually a form of a vitamin manufactured by plants. Mammals do not actually make this vitamin intrinsically, but fortunately we get a lot of this through our diet. If our bodies do not produce enough of this vitamin B5, we can develop a rare condition called pantothenic acid deficiency. And so why is pantothenic acid so important for our body processes? Now when pantothenic acid enters our body, it actually forms pantothene, and pantothene is a more stable form of pantothenic acid. Now pantothene is a cofactor in over 70 different enzyme activity in our body including fatty acid oxidation, carbohydrate metabolism, helps with amino acid catabolism, helps with making heme, which is a part of your red blood cells. It also helps with making acetylcholine, which is a neurotransmitter. It also helps with detoxing your body as well. Now, pantothene is also involved in the initial steps of cholesterol synthesis, as well as breaking down uh, metabolites of cholesterol, including vitamin D, bile acids, and steroids. Now we can consume pantothenic acid by actually obtaining it through our diet. A lot of it is in brewer's yeast, you know, uh, nutritional yeast, calf liver are excellent sources. In addition, you can eat peanuts, split peas, pecans, oatmeal, mushrooms, soybeans, buckwheat, sunflower seeds, uh, red chili peppers, avocados, lentils, cashews, and other whole grains and nuts that do have a good source of pantothenic acid. Now again, pantothene, uh, vitamin B5, is used a lot in lipid profile dysfunction. So if you find that you might have uh, cholesterol issues, vitamin B5 has been known to support uh, your lipid profile. Other things is also adrenal function enhancement. This is why it's so important in adrenal fatigue recovery. Uh, is because vitamin B5 is a cofactor needed to help make cortisol. Pantothenic acid is an important nutrient to maintain an optimal adrenal function. And so when the adrenal gland fails to function, our bodies will not be able to produce progesterone, cortisol, even estrogen. And this leads to estrogen dominance and so and a variety of other hormonal issues. Other conditions vitamin B5 has been shown to help with is Crohn's or colitis, uh, gout, autoimmune and allergic conditions, uh, wound healing, again related to the adrenals and stress uh, enhancement, and then also cholesterol and triglyceride stabilization. Be aware that when you do start taking vitamin B5 and pantothene, oftentimes you can have a paradoxical reaction, especially if you're in the later stages of adrenal fatigue. So remember, you always have to start slow and go slow. Don't take a shotgun approach to your body because you have to take a systematic approach. So start low, go slow, and pantothene can do wonders for your body.